on the 26th of December 2004, a towering tsunami generated by a submarine earthquake slammed into Southeast Asia. The giant wave surged inland along the coasts of India and Indonesia, leaving a trail of destruction in its wake. The day the tsunami struck, the Jason satellite was on hand to measure the offshore sea level anomaly. The amplitude of the phenomenon exceeded 50 centimeters across several hundred kilometers. After the event, scientists compared the satellite's readings with in situ coastal data to validate their propagation model. This model is used to predict how a tsunami will propagate from out at sea toward the coast. The scientists' verdict was that the simulation closely matched actual events in Southeast Asia and could be extended to other seismically active areas around the globe. Scientists are also studying how a tsunami originating off the coast of Africa would propagate across the Mediterranean. The most vulnerable coastlines would be in North Africa and then, half an hour later, the Balearic Islands and Andalusia. Further away, the destructive wave could even reach the Camargue two hours after the tremor. This type of model helps to determine which coastal areas are most at risk and to establish early warning systems.